Hey, what's happening people? It's your boy Stefan Davis with Stefan Davis TV and I'm doing a slightly different video today specifically for those who use Adobe Premiere Pro CS5. Now, I use Adobe Premiere Pro CS5. I've used it ever since it came out and I've been really happy with it and I haven't felt the need to upgrade to CC until potentially now. Now, what has happened is in Adobe Premiere Pro CS5 as of the last maybe week and a half, um all of a sudden the splash screen the loading splash screen has been getting stuck on if you look to the screen this exporting quicktime host thingy um now um, i actually found the file originally and i took it out of whatever directory it was and it booted fine but then i couldn't export to quicktime read a whole load of forums on adobe's website and other people's opinions and a lot of people said it came down to either firewall issues or making sure that quicktime was up to date none of those things worked for me so in light of this and in case other people have suffered with the same thing this is what i did to make it work for me now i wish i'd done this first because doing all the workarounds with the firewall and the quicktime and the uninstalling the whole of the premiere pro cs5 package and um, a, a production premium package and then reinstalling it, all of that just took forever. So, if you're watching this, this is what I did. I created a new user on my machine, made sure that all my information was backed up on another a hard drive, and in the new user, for some reason, all of the connections, the signals, the infrastructure of uh, production premium just seemed to work fine, work like a dream and um that did it now yes it's a hassle if you've got all your plugins and everything set up it's a hassle but like i said i uninstalled production premium i uninstalled quicktime and reinstalled it twice and it didn't work um but creating a new user that did work so Hopefully this will help somebody out there who's googled this same code. It will be in the description um, and Give this video a thumbs up if it worked for you if this is like because I couldn't find any videos about it either So give a thumbs up if you, this worked for you as you can see it's still loading. So yeah um, But yeah, give a thumbs up if this worked for you I'm gonna switch over to my other account and then I will show you how quickly it loaded right now Okay, so here we are in my brand new user and I haven't set it up as I have usually but I'm going to click on Premiere Pro. Let's see how quickly it loads and if there's any issues. So it's there and it skipped through QuickTime hosting and voila, there we go. So like I said, like this video if that helped you, uh, leave a comment if this works or if there are other things that you've tried that have worked. Hopefully I've helped somebody out there because like I said, I took ages googling this issue so let me know what you think and i will see you hopefully on the next video